Hey guys, what is going on? It is Deboki here once again, and today is going to be a grandpa solo boss run dealio thing. <laughs> Sorry I haven't made a video in such a long time, but I've been really busy with school and work and stuff like that, and yeah, I just thought I'd go ahead and make this video really quick and get one out for you guys because, well, it's been a while, and you know, five days or so. Um, but yeah, so I will be filming though this same boss run again later, but I'll actually be having one of the strongest wild hunters in Kiny and maybe even in Maple Story. No, I don't know about Maple Story, but yeah, I found him. His name is Phil, and I'll go ahead and be. I, I don't know if I should say his IGN right now. I'll, I'll leave that a surprise for you guys, but yeah, he's really strong, and I just thought I'd go ahead and I asked him, you know, if he could come in if I could see his range and if he could star on my YouTube video because I want to motivate some of you wild hunters out there you know just really how strong and powerful and the true potential a wild hunter can have so I mean it's pretty cool he's really powerful and you know of course we won't reach his level but it's just it's fun to see some big numbers pop out you know so it's 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 pretty cool but yeah so I'll be go ahead and filming that next time and his his time of boss run is probably like triple mine, so I mean, I take 20 minutes to do this, and he'll probably take like five. <laughs> so I mean, it's it's um, it's all good though. It's what it is, and yeah, if you guys don't know what the boss is, he's like Zach, but he has like three stages also, like Zach, and he's got two bodyguards, and then his own form comes out, and they all have like hundreds and hundreds of million of HP, but so it takes a while, and ooh, what was that? Did I get something? A message? I did. Hey, Deboki, can I ask you a question? Sure. Someone was talking to me on Facebook. Yeah, if you guys haven't added me on Facebook yet, go ahead and do so. <laughs> but, um, yeah, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, what I wanted to talk to you guys about in this video is school and life, I guess. Uh, again, you guys are like, oh, man, Deboki, again about this life crap but yeah I mean we live it so it's kinda hard not to talk about it um, a lot of you guys are like starting school and stuff and going into new schools maybe even starting high school or starting middle school or college and man it's it's crazy it's scary isn't it cuz like you're in a new whole territory you're on the bottom of the food chain and you know you're literally the fresh meat coming in and you just you feel like sometimes you have to put up this barrier huh like you don't want anything to come in and you want to be careful your first impression of what you make and you don't want to like get a nickname on the first week of school and there he is messaging me again let me see here oh asking me about classes like usual <laughs> um yeah and it's just it's funny because like if we go through our whole school career with that how how do we um Sorry, I was reading the message again. Oh, I gotta stop. I gotta stop doing this, like, multitasking crap. But, like, how are we supposed to find out who we truly are and really meet people if we just put on this shell, you know? Because the people that meet us, the types of introverts that we are, will are the ones that reach out and, you know, not have that shell. So if we all reached out and, like, I don't know, be, like, crazy enthusiastic we might get shot but we also might meet a lot of fun people so I thought that was kinda cool you know like in like the first day of school for me I see myself just like really not reaching out to anyone you know just my own bubble get in get out as quick as possible but really like you're gonna be in the school for 365 days and man this guy let me tell you oh is it a different person it is I might have to redo this video, but I don't really feel like it because I have to leave for work soon. <laughs> but yeah, so you're spending work, or er, work, work, okay, I have to go to work soon. But you guys are spending your most of your time in school. And if you have to live up, be this, you know, really introverted person through like all year, it's going to be pretty depressing. So I thought, you know, tell you guys to go out and meet someone new, reach out to someone that you wouldn't expect to reach out to because who knows you know that could be a really cool person you guys could really get along and you think oh but that guy's so much cooler than me but so what if he's has this cool aura around him you know 
Just because a battle mage has dark aura, you can still absorb it, so why not absorb the cool aura? Oh, no, don't use that analogy in school, because you'll probably get beaten up. <laughs> It'll be like, are you talking about Maple Story? <laughs> but, um, yeah, so, I mean, it's, it's, it's fun to reach out sometimes and, like, really to see your inner personality. You know, like when you're singing in the bathroom and you won't let anyone else hear you sing. Yeah, maybe sing out loud. Not, like, literally sing out loud, but, like, let your inner shine out and be friendly and stuff. I don't know. I don't know what kind of mood I'm in right now, but I just thought I'd, I want to share with you guys and hopefully encourage some of you guys out there that are just wanting to get in and out of school as quick as possible. But like, you know, maybe join some clubs, do some fun stuff with other people. And yeah, maybe you guys all do have a lot of friends and I'm just the only one that's a loser in the corner. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I mean, it's just, it's fun because uh, people are fun, and we have to live with them for the rest of our lives, and so why not Why not be sociable, I guess. And also, MapleStory, it helps us become more sociable, I feel. Like I was talking to you guys about in like my early Chaos Zakum video, about not MapleStory, but our story. And it's like, it shapes us. It shapes our personality, and it builds our character. And it really like, you know how we type, we can type like, anything we want out loud but like when we say something it's kind of like the opposite you know we're like kind of holding back like oh you know I don't know if I should say that but yeah so I mean it's kind of like that so if we have like our same personality like our outgoing enthusiasm in like real life we can maybe achieve a lot more and it'll be a lot more fun to live so hopefully you guys will you guys listen to some of what I had to say and wasn't just like, wow, is the bookie still talking right now? Is he going to ever shut up? But yes, I will, because what time is it? 3.40? I do have to go to work now. But guys, like always, thank you so much for watching. This has been the bookie. And oh yeah, I got 900 subscribers, which is awesome. 100 more to go. Yay. Till 1,000, which I was never expecting. But yeah, so thank you guys. You guys are awesome. And um... Yeah, just go ahead and leave a comment, say hello, and I'll be seeing you guys later. Cheers.